the plugin we're going to be using to scroll back up is going to be scroll press right so we just go over here to google and you can see that i found a scroll press so we just go over here and it again right away explains what we need to do right so first we, they're saying that if we're downloading we need a css over here in our heading and scroll press gss over here and here we would need uh, it works with a font awesome so we for sure would need to have a font awesome which we do and over here this is a script that we would need right so either again we would create a file or we'd actually and we can just place it somewhere in the bottom right well because i was lazy i just place it here in the bottom and you can see that i already downloaded right here it is in my gs right this is where it is and over here in my index i already added it over here like this so it has a g uh, js scroll press and if we go all the way to the top i added also a scroll press css right what we need to do over here is we obviously need to add the path right and then here would they say that is right away done but here they show us what kind of things we can change so first let's just check it out how it looks like right so you, you can see over here this one right so you press it over here you can see how it scrolls back to the top right and again if we if we're scrolling let's say down right it appears so we can we like again go up right and if you go over here to this documentation you can see over here where they say right let's say that this one right back background color white right then what what icon are they using right and over here uh there's going to be also duration we're going to go somewhere somewhere here should be duration right duration thousand right so if we go to our js file right scroll press js and we just go to the top and we're going to start looking for uh, things that we can change right so the first one duration right so let's say change it from thousand to four thousand then angle up let's say far desktop desktop and over here let's say background color let's change it to red right so we can just save this and let's go back to the sushi slide all the way you can see right now i have a desktop right and obviously there's a, another things that you can change but we just picked like the three kind of uh, main ones i guess well the most not noticeable ones right and we just click it over here and you can see that it takes much more slower because we set a different duration right now that we have added all our plugins right we can just check it out what we have we have a web page that basically is going to be flipping and it's going to be fading in left and right as we're going to be hovering over it you can see that we're going to be able to uh, have the opacity right and then over here this is going to be flipping in over here like this then there's going to be over here this uh, footer right and we can actually zoom in all the way back to the top and obviously this is also transparent so as we're making it i'm sorry this is responsive so as we're actually uh, you know make this bigger or smaller you can see that it's still happening right and we have over here this little icon that again would take us back the way all the way to the top then over here we have our iframe right with our uh, google maps and everything right so again as we press it over here we can scroll back all the way to the top this is going to be our menu right and so this is going to be it for this video guys thank you very much for watching and i'll see you in the next video